Wow. Really? Yeah. 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 Of course you would. Just randomly stop working. But anyway, I was about to go to bed. And at 3.16 a.m., currently 3.25 a.m., I saw that it said update queued. This was only a couple hours after I ended that last video. I didn't think it would be this early. I thought it was going to probably be anywhere between 6 and 10 a.m. Wow. This last little bit has taken a lot to load, which is as usual, right? Something will be at 100%, near 100%, or at, you know, show 100%, and then th that'll be what takes the longest. Just bought Witcher 3 on PC, by the way. You know, the full complete edition. Well, it's called Game of the Year Edition now, but will be called Complete Edition shortly on December 14th with the free next gen update. I've played like the first two or so hours of The Witcher 3 like a year ago, two years ago now maybe, on the PS5. And I've never uploaded it because I was I can't even say I got bored of the game. It's just I've always found something that I wanted to play more at the time. I eventually did want to get back into it, but I was just holding it off till <laughs> I did everything else that I wanted to do. But with this next gen update, new stuff being added, which I don't know what that new stuff is because I haven't even played the base game, but um, I'm excited. And of course, I had to get it for PC because mods and stuff you, you just have to didn't upgrade my PC for nothing right okay this is taking way too long I'll pause the recording also also just wanted to add as you can see I got prototype prototype 2 a few few nights ago as well <laughs> I was wondering if they were gonna be on Steam I was so happy when I saw that they were so hyped to play those games again so good. Wow. Verifying. It is 3.44 a.m. <laughs> and it only just recently got to that verifying status. It was still at 1.62 gigabytes out of 1.62 gigabytes. Play. Play. Jeez. <sighs> I went on Twitch to see if anyone else was actually in game and playing instead of waiting for it to load like me. Uh people I, I don't I don't think anyone was playing it yet. I think it's I think I'm good. I think I'm one of the first ones. <laughs> Come on, bruh. Okay, that's fine. Is th are the Coliseum doors open, though? I think I, ha I would have to interact with it to open it. Yes! The dude is gone! Which was my fear. Earlier when I was recording, I was like... I should have spoken to him to see what the dialogue was. Limgrave Coliseum. United Combat and Combat Ordeals. To engage in combat with other players, touch the effigy of America in a coliseum. United combat and combat ordeals can be undertaken in this venue. In United combat, two teams of fighters clash, 
Combat or duels are, are all out brawls in which every combatant is out for themselves. So where's what's one v one? Well, from what I understand, that's two v. This is two v two and three v three, or sorry, two v two and then all out brawls, which could be role played into three v three. I guess. <laughs> I fucked up. I should have I should have already done it. Oh my god, I didn't pick up the, or is it because I'm offline? Is it because I'm offline? Or is it because I didn't pick up the messaging thing? I don't think I picked up the messaging thing in this playthrough yet. Let me try to go figure that out. All right, no, it was the tarnished, wizened, or wizened finger, um, which I have. Um, but I guess it's because I'm offline, because the game is apparently still undergoing maintenance. In which case, why did you let me in? This sucks, though. I have to say I'm actually disappointed. I was hoping through the doors would be the actual Coliseum, not a transport to the Coliseum. It is what it is, though. Whatevs. Like I said, I'm actually super sad that I didn't talk to Buddy before he was forever gone. You will be missed. Gone, but never forgotten. Alright. Hopefully it lets me go online. That's a wrap on that. 3.51 a.m. Gotta go to bed. Rip. I'm gonna pause the recording and then just play it again after we, you know, resume the recording after I wake up. <laughs> so, see you in a few hours. If I don't die in my sleep. Alright, just woke up uh, not too long ago. The servers were live and everything like 10 minutes after I stopped the recording last night uh, this morning early this morning um, can't really say early this morning like, well early this morning <laughs> I was about to say mid morning at yeah, like 4 a.m. Um, but at that point I was ready to go to sleep so combat ordeal united combat I wish it would remind me what it was. I never read it last night, but I, I forgot. Uh, America's effigy at the round table. What? Sick. Sick. The beautiful convenience. My goodness.
Wow, I haven't opened this up since I began this playthrough. Hilarious. Um, I was hoping maybe it would have something reminding me what the difference was between combat or doing United Combat. Um, I think it was at the combat ordeal at first, so let me just stick with that. If it says remaining combatant is one, does that mean it's a 1v1? Uh oh. I'm going in with, uh, not full. HP or FP. Oh, okay. We're good. Oh! Okay. No, uh... Yeah. I absolutely suck at PvP, by the way. Oh, they're going to try to get the... <laughs> Good luck. Oh fuck, dude. Oh, this sucks. Oh, you could heal. Do I want to though? I'll only heal if they'll heal. Oh my god, my attack missed, but there's a hit. Oh, GG. I was trying to bow, and they started attacking me immediately. Wait, what? What? There's multiple rounds? What, is that what combat ordeal means? What is this phantom range, dude? Oh my god, that follow-up didn't hit him. I'm getting thrown off by this phantom range, dude. GG. Is how many rounds is this? Eliminations? Okay, cool. Okay, I'm 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 confused. Trying to be unpredictable, but it's not really working out in my favor here.
GG. Combatant E Girl? <laughs> That's that was the name. <laughs> I didn't even pay attention to the name. Oh, at least I got a round off. Not worth. Dude, that's stun. Like I said, I don't know anything about PvP. I, I, all the invasions or duels I've done in the game in my previous recordings is all I've done, period. Cease combat. Oh, there's a time limit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. While I was trying to uh, bow... At first, I got hit, which uh, I'm going to use it as an excuse for why this all turned bad. That was, okay, that was combat ordeal. Is, are my, okay, cool. I did have throwing daggers, and I did have blood grease. Um, yeah, I'll try united combat. See what that's about. But it's nice that there is 1v1 here. Instead of what I was fearing, which was this not being a 1v1 Coliseum. But uh, after this next match, I'm going to go ahead and uh, hop off for today because I got to go to work. <laughs> I just wanted to jump on and get a taste of it. I also wanted to take my time looking around the arena, seeing the architecture, but I had to focus. I'm surprised it's actually taking this long, and I'm and I was surprised that it took as long as it did for the first first uh, session as well to find the first combatant, because I would assume a lot of people are playing right now for this. So does it cancel it if you leave the building? Nice. Yeah, too bad I couldn't get my message out last night. Yeah? Really? Good thing this isn't a Dark Souls 2 with the weapon durability, right? Yeah, that's fun. But. Something as simple. Because I didn't want to get teleported away without having finished the message, so I just went with whatever. Um, it's taking a while. And I need to go to work, so... I was hoping uh, I'd jump in for one more. Can I sever... Cancel? Oh, there you go. Oh, cool. Or, or wait, did I misunderstand that? We have to go kill other enemies? Or we what? Dude, what is that range? What is that range?
What is that? Okay. Alright. What is that range? I can't get that off. Oh, you can drink here. GG easy. GG. I took I took my damn thing off. <laughs> my bow gesture like an idiot. Fuck. What is that range? What is that range? Dude, the fucking dagger from the previous fight and then this knight and flame sword. Like, what is that range? I don't understand. Okay, all right. This is why I never really take Souls Souls games uh, PvP seriously. Like the range is fucking ridiculous. How did he hit me? But I didn't hit him there. There we go. Waited for the roll there. Fuck. Trying to outspace. GG. What the fuck, dude? Oh, we're not done. <laughs> Both look like a bunch of idiots. Dude! My fucking roll didn't come through? Okay, they still had their heal. I don't know how I didn't get hit by the second one there. If I had the phantom range that sorted, I would hit him right now. I just did the the uh, the Ash of War at the very end there, but it was too late. I wanted to finish it off with that. Lose fucking message would ruin it. That was fun. 
I'm not sure still though what the difference was between the two modes there. I think it was because of uh, the second one was time restri restricted. Is that what that was? I forget if the first one had a timer. But anyway, let me let me not be a retard here. Uh, where is the bow? There it is. As you wish. I think there was another one, right? So not that one, by the way. Uh, and then how do you do it? Is it A, uh, X? Of course. I was pressing square on the PlayStation, which is X, on you know to remove. But I was trying to do it. So I was trying to do it at the very beginning when I got hit immediately. Well, that was fun. I'll definitely be hopping on again uh, after work, God willing. If I don't die coming back from work <laughs> at work. You never know. You never know. In your sleep, uh, in the car, at work, you never know. Anyway, uh, I think I'll actually just pause the recording and then pick it up when I come back. So, see you in a bit, which is going to be immediate. And just like that, it's been 11 hours since I paused the video. Came back from work. Eight. If my controller would start working, at, okay. Um. Preparing myself for disappointment for when Elden Ring is does not get a trailer, a story trailer tomorrow at the Game Awards. Hold on. I'm glad it was just a hair. I think a mustache hair. I felt something on the roof of my mouth. And I got spooked. It was on the roof of my mouth and my left canine, if you will, upper canine. I forget what they're called. Incisor, I think. The fang. <laughs> I think it's called incisor. Um, the sharp teeth. Anyway. Both players are divided into two teams and given a limited time, 300 seconds, to compete for the highest number of downed enemies. Use of the flask of crimson serenity is permitted, but limited in number is prohibited. Um, so yeah, preparing myself for disappointment for when there's no Elden Ring stuff, no new Elden Ring story DLC announced tomorrow at the Game Awards. Um, and then there was one other thing. Yeah, and this time when I'm playing these matches, I'm going to actually try to remember that I have spells. Because <laughs> in those previous two fights, I uh, was just doing a Bloodhound, Bloodhound Fang. Um wasn't even using the katana as well, which that was on purpose, but forgetting about the spells was not on purpose. And it's nice that you don't have to uh, go and refill your FP or HP or whatever, and it'll just get automatically full, uh, you know, reset. Once the match starts, because it's not like there's a grace in here or anything. It would be so awesome if this was actually open, though. And even if you can't enter the Coliseum proper, that there's like a transparent fog wall or something or barrier where you're still able to see into it. And it's like, well, you got to register over here to get in there. You know, the fact that you can't see it at all. It's disappointing. Well, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and pause the recording until I f enter a match. Um, also disappointing that <laughs> I did not continue this playthrough some more before this released. Although it was sudden. It was literally like tomorrow it's coming out. Um, but I did hear a streamer saying that mid-December something was dropping. Like, towards the end of last month, I heard that, so... How credible it was, though, I, I didn't know. But... 
the fact that I can't get to Kaled. Well, actually, I could get to the Kaled one. I could get to the Kaled one right now, actually. But even if I do, I doubt I'm going to find anyone around my level, which I believe is currently 48. And of course, don't have access to uh, Lane Dell. So, I wish I had access to at least those areas. But I, as I said during part 6 of this playthrough, um, I'm waiting for DLC. Story DLC before I jump back in. Well, anyway, I'm going to pause the recording now because I ran out of things that I wanted to say. Okay, been waiting for a while now. Um, it's about 11.30 p.m. Central Standard Time for me right now, so... I would assume there's still enough people to play, but I guess guess not. Uh, they're probably all in Landil or Kaled. Which is unfortunate. Or that type of battle that I was going for isn't available. But uh, one thing that I noticed while I was waiting there I was kind of just looking through stuff. Because I, I didn't remember whether... Because I know I didn't explore through Stormville proper yet. But I didn't remember if I killed Godric or not. So yes, I did kill him. Um, so when I'll be going there, I'll going back there. I'll just be taking it real nice and slow. Clearing out everything else. Picking up all the items. <laughs> uh, the other thing I noticed was... I did not have the grace for the limb grave divine tower so i was like wait i never got activated godric's great rune and i did not so i'm actually just gonna to wrap up the video here i'm gonna go ahead and quickly do that I'm fortunate that this whole video is about the coliseum but at the same time i only got two matches in um but whatever i'll uh oh Part of me wants to leave this alone. And if part of me wants to leave this alone, part of me wants me to just leave alone. Activating the Great Rune. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to leave it alone. Because I didn't want to really pick up any new items or anything until I properly started Part 7 of this playthrough. Which is going to be... This weekend, God willing. Yes. Man. The reason why I don't want to go through with uh, sitting through matchmaking to find someone else again is... I kind of... I'm just... I just want to wrap it all up here. Get through... You know, done, get done with my playthrough. And then once I'm done with my playthrough, I'll go up into the arenas and coliseums and whatnot. Uh, probably ending at around level 150 for this character. But also, I want to get through tomorrow. I want to get through tomorrow the game awards. Know for sure one way or another if we get PvE story DLC. right? Um, announcement. And if we get a date. I'm hoping it's yes. And that it's like February or something like that. But, you know, I'm not, at the same time, if it, if it isn't announced, I'm not that disappointed, honestly. I'm just going to go through, you know, with playing the game all the way through every little nook and cranny as planned either way. But also, I'm not that worried about it, even if it doesn't get announced, because you know it's coming. This game, so many people have following it so early like myself before I even played any of the Souls games and of course even after I've played them the excitement has just been that much greater and the anticipation has just been that much greater and before I knew it before anyone knew it there was a closed network test before anyone knew it it was released and now it's been 10 months since then so it's coming and once it's here and once it's completed, 
that's that, you know? Unless there's another DLC kit coming, which there might be, but that's that. So, there's actual enjoyment in the wait. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.